Along the street of sorrow, the boulevard of broken dreams. Where a chicken low and chicken let can't steal a kiss without regret when they forget their broken dreams. You laugh tonight and cry tomorrow when you behold your shattered schemes. And chicken low and chicken let wake up to find their eyes are wet. Tears that tell of broken dreams Here is where you'll always find me Always walking up and down But I left my soul behind me In an old cathedral town The joy that you find here you borrow You cannot keep it long in the sea
cheese, and I'm going to ask Adrian if you'd hold those words up so I can see them. Can you see them? Come up here, come up here, come up here. No, I can't see them. Anything like that. No, you don't stand in front of the camera. That's all right. That's, that's good. So if you could hold it up about I think it's a very good looking music stand. That's it. That's great. The best looking music that's stand ever. I sort of know it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. <laughs> this, is, um, this is a song about that awful thing that happens when you get a melody in your brain that won't go away. And it reminds you of, or love, and of pain, and the whole damn thing. <laughs> this song is called Padam Padam Padam. <laughs> song in Hindi. What's Hindi? Lays eggs. <laughs> <laughs> um, so Cliff is detuning his guitar and he'll play a little evening raga for you while I explain that this is a song about a very large tomato. <laughs> I went to the market and I paid four ekdo tincha, that's four. Can you say that? Ek do tin cha, that's one, two, three, four in Hindi. Pays very small amount of money for a very large tomato. And when I got it home and washed it, it broke four taps. 
And when I tried to cut it, it broke four knives. And when I tried to eat it, it broke four teeth. So this is the song. So Clint will play a little in evening raga for you. string, you know. <laughs> Please hold it Please hold it <laughs> This one's a bit of an improvisational piece, but it was originally recorded by Mr. Django Reinhardt and Stephen Grappelli in the 30s, I think. And uh, it's an improvisation, so you can do what you like, but uh, it's good fun. Here we go. Minor swing. <laughs>
chord bass players keep it cheap, you know. to learn this is um, a lovely uh, classic Australian song and it's got a really easy chorus it goes like this is he an Aussie Lizzie is he is he an Aussie Lizzie hey is he because he is an Aussie that he makes you dizzy Lizzie as he jazzy ways and does he make you go all fuzzy wuzzy got you dizzy as he Lizzie is he an Aussie is he hey you have to do that won't you <laughs> Try this bit, there you go. Is it because he is an Aussie that he makes you dizzy? 
laugh the whole night through. Well, you can cry me a river, cry me a river. I cried a river over you. Now you say you're sorry for being so untrue. Well, you can cry me a river, cry me a river. I cried a river over you. You drove me, baby, drove me out of my head. Told me you were through with me And now you say you love me Well, just to prove you do Well, you can cry me a river Cry me a river I cried a river over you Night with the Flying Horses, which was all about circuses and shows. Do you remember the shows? You used to go to the shows when I was a teenager. It was very exciting. The Candy rides, floss and side clack, side alley and all. And, and, all that kind and of the game. side shows. Elder and, Skelters, I love them. And the carnies. This is a song that I wrote to evoke those days for you all, bring memories back. You're probably a little bit too young. <laughs> Never mind, that's all right. <clears throat> He smelt of a bear and he moved like a wolf and he shone with sweat in the lights of the fair and his teeth were all white and the oil in his hair and he growled as he took me down to the dirt in my shiny black shoes and wide hoop skirt. Her smell was so sweet as fresh fairy floss and her eyes were black as oil and her hair was so wild and her jewelry glow. She hissed like a snake as I lowered her down toffee apple melt down to the cool of the ground Oh, you might call it sin. I told you. 
not a lady. to do a little Italian song. You being a little Italian might like it. <laughs> <laughs> they brought all these blokes over from New Zealand to be bouncers outside the nightclubs in Sydney. And you know, big brown blokes with broken noses. You know the type, yeah, yeah. fuck and, off, and, sir. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> and uh, they do such a marvellous job that they actually wrote a verse of that song just for them, which goes like this. When the moon hits your eye like your big pizza pie, that's amore. Sit by a pool and an eel bites your heel, that's a more. When you mix up some cheese and some ham and some cream, that's a more. This is 
is a, this is a new song to us and I hope it'll be a new song to you. It's just, it's such a beauty. It's really old and it's absolutely in the worst taste. So I hope you'll like it. <laughs> Ah! <laughs> yeah, you know what I found this? In a small village near here called Macclesfield. Oh. And there was this box next to the, next to the lakes and all that with uh, anything in this box is one dollar. So I looked through these LCDs and these a picture of Johnny Cash on the front and I went, there you go, there's a dollar. And uh, call it it. And it's the worst track on the album, the Johnny Cash one, it was just an eye catcher, yeah. And we found this. Listen to this. <laughs> Is a plastic fire guard. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> okay, this is um, this is possibly our final song for tonight. That's up to you, I guess. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh. Mr. Wright, could I borrow one of your seven thousand dollar beautiful guitars that you made yourself? <laughs> sure. sure. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what you tell me. We're going to make me one for. I am going to try and get Timothy, when I've got the money, to make me a guitar. And this is one of Tim's guitars, and Young Junior used it before, so let's try it out. It's more for the country stuff, you know, a steel string thing. <laughs> Quite honest, folks, I tried one of his guitars out the other week and I was playing things I'd never played before, like all kinds of stuff. So 
Something like that. <laughs> the action's fantastic on it. There's gonna be more practice on that. Okay. So, um, this is a song. We're gonna do the song now that we, we wrote in Tamworth in 10 minutes. Oh, I'll, I'll put the kettle on then? No, no, no. <laughs> no. We wrote it in 10 minutes, except the last verse, which we wrote in India. But that's another story. You've heard of India, haven't you? Get it, India. <laughs> <laughs> so, look, this has got a really easy chorus, okay? It goes like this. And this is all about the days before Cliff and I settled down and had dogs. And, well, we didn't have them, but we got chooks and, you know, all that sort of stuff. And, and couldn't leave to go around the world like we used to do. <gasps> anyway, this goes, this is called The Journey. And this is a little bit for you to do, which goes like this.
Mum, how are you going? <laughs> okay, we'll actually do a couple of quickies. Yeah, sure. Okay. You, you can join in with both of them. Hang on, I don't, I don't like this guitar. <laughs> <laughs> Only kidding. Timothy, thank you very much for the use of your guitar and your shop. Thank you. 